Morning, we're a bit further away from home this morning and um, we've come to Strumblehead Lighthouse. We're doing a 12 mile walk. It's really cold. Beautiful day. Um, not sure how we're going to get on with 12 miles, but we'll give it a go. Here he comes. <laughs> Amazing views and light. So beautiful. So it's, what is it, about half, to, half eight, I think? So yeah, good to be out early in the morning. Whilst this is a lovely walk, it's incredibly boggy. My feet are covered in mud already. And this is what it's like. Uh, so we're not able to go particularly fast because we keep having to find dry areas to wade through. Jonathan was saying how impressive he thought the sea view was, but I actually just said what's more impressive for me is the inland view, with the dry, dry stone walling, and there's a field of cows there. I'll see if I can zoom in. They are so pretty. Um, yeah, it's really lovely. I'm hoping you can see Jonathan up there. He's still got a bit of a way to climb. Some of the books say that this coastal path walk is easy. Definitely isn't easy. We've come from down there. Amazing views. Sorry, I know I keep using the word amazing all the time. I don't know what else to say. Um, yeah, I'm just passing time so I don't have to get to the top of this. Oh, we made it to the top. It's bitterly cold up here. I don't know if you can see in the distance the uh, Irish ferries on its way in. And Jonathan is standing in the remnants of a World War II watchtower. Yep. Yeah. But that was a little bit reminiscent of when we climbed up parts of Snowdon. I would not call that an easy coastal path route. Enjoyable anyway, but uh, I'm just trying to give you the full 360 degrees. And you can see the lighthouse over there. That's where we started. But like I say, we're going at a very slow pace today. Well, it has turned into a bit of an adventure. We lost the path, we couldn't find it anywhere. We've been up and down, looking around, and we've ended off on another footpath that we've used the map to find. I don't think it's used very often, it's very, very overgrown. But anyway, hopefully we will uh, find our way back to where we're supposed to be. We're back at last. Uh, that was quite a struggle because um, it was nine miles in the end. We got a bit lost. We're quite glad because it was very up and down and we are shattered. So say we've been going for about four and a half hours and I'd be very glad to have a sit down in the car.